Hey guys, what's going on? Well, just wanted to share something with you that I figured out that I shouldn't know a long time ago that I'm sure I've been told. Uh, it's about code plugs and how to transfer, how to transfer them. Uh, there's cloning and you can clone the radios as long as they're the exact same model number. Uh, you can do that. Sometimes I think cloning needs to be enabled on that. But uh, one thing that you can do is that if you've got a Model 2 and you've got a Model 3, uh, you can drag and drop. And that will save you so much time in the CPS, you just would not believe it. Uh, so much better. If you've got one radio, this radio's got 18 scan lists uh, set into it as does this. Uh, it is pretty much mated to uh, to this radio here. What I did was I I read the radio, read this radio, minimized and shrunk the pane. Then I hooked this radio up and I uh, read that code plug then you can drag and drop you minimize the pain and you put it over on the other half of the screen so you've got two separate uh, tree views and you can save so much time doing it I, I hadn't looked at the tips in a while and had I looked at the tips and paid a little more attention to it uh, I would have been a lot better off because I've been doing this manually and that means setting up every radio manually. Uh, that's a lot to do. And when you're talking 255 channels, that's a lot to do. So drag and drop, what you can do is you just hold down on your mouse on the personalities. You can move them over and it'll say either add it end, add it beginning, or overwrite. And so you've got your choice of how you want to do that. It works with scan lists, it works with zones, it works with the menus, uh, really makes it easy. So drag and drop is what I found uh, the quickest way, aside from, aside from actual cloning the radio. These, these housings are just so nice. I am getting two uh, R-Split uh, 403-470 Model 2s in. The housings aren't as nice as this one, as this one, but this one's brand new. So, and so is the keypad, and so is really everything on this unit, uh, brand new. But the Model 3s, all of the radios, uh, I can save so much time now uh, through the drag and drop that uh, I don't have to go set up each individual zone personality by personality, do all those steps, do all the scan lists. All you have to do is just drag and drop, drag and drop. If you've got, uh, you know, if you've got the same radios, you can do that. It may work from XDS 3000s to 5000s. I don't know on that. Uh, I'll find out in short order, but uh, I would stick. No, you can't because the CPS is different. There's two different programs. Sorry. Uh, but anyway, it may be possible, I don't know, I'm not going to mess around with that. But uh, dragging and dropping will ensure that uh, you can quickly transfer your data over if you're not going to clone the radios. And, you know, every time you drag and drop and you click over, right, it's going to copy what's on channel 1 on this to channel 1 on this all the way across the board. Really, really good and uh, it's so easy to do, it's quick. Uh, I did get a couple backup programming cables. Uh, also got a USB backup uh, adapter. But yeah, I'm getting two more. Uh, there are split 403, 470s in. And they won't be as nice as this, but these are, you know, like I said, these are brand new housings. I do have another housing coming in in safety yellow and uh, that's going to be going on a Model 3. Uh, I may sell these housings 
uh, separate but it just depends but if you guys a lot of people have been asking me about model threes and R splits well I'm getting two in so uh, the two model threes that are or I mean two model twos that are uh, in the 403 470 if you're wanting one get a hold of me uh, but I'm not going to give the radios away you know they're expensive units you need to know that and they come at a price just like anything else and you get what you pay for so but the code blocks will be loaded up proper uh, all 255 channels will be loaded in scanless will be loaded in to where everything will run consecutively uh, you know there's no problem with any of the radios that I've uh, that I carry so but I've held off on uh, listing uh, these for right now. Uh, I'm possibly, I may get some more of these in. Uh, I'm not sure, but I'm holding off uh, listing right now because I'm working on a deal. If this guy's uh, source uh, buyer does not, uh, is not able to come through, then I'm going to go ahead and, uh, and take the rest of his units uh, so hopefully you know that'll work out if it doesn't the guy's a real good guy and uh, that'll be good also uh, rapid chargers I was able to score 14 of them no 12 of them got a dozen uh, that are on their way in and I've needed those very very badly uh, and hopefully uh, they're all clean they've all got brand new cords uh, they were all tested and they were kind of a pain in the ass to, do it, to work a deal with but at the same time uh, you know not too bad I to picking up radio traffic uh, but anyway uh, so I've got some units that are model ones that are listed that are 800 megahertz uh, I'm looking at another 800 megahertz as a model 2 but uh, I'm not sure if I'm going to get that because 800 megahertz uh, isn't really uh, that much in demand. You know, some areas need them, some don't. It just kind of depends. Let me turn this down. Just turn it off. On some two on that one. But anyway, uh, drag and drop. That's the best way to do it. You know, look that up in your in in the help and the tutorials. And believe me, it'll save you so much. So much uh, time in programming uh, that I don't know why in the world I didn't stumble onto it before. I know I've been told about it, but I guess I forgot about it. But uh, I just picked it up again, and uh, it's very quick and it's very easy. But, you know, with any CPS, you need to know what you're doing. So always check for invalid fields and uh, save your code plugs before you start to do any kind of alterations. You should be good. Take it easy, guys. Beautiful units. Very, very happy with these units. These are both VHF and the wide bands are just killer. Signal pull is incredible. So anyway, guys, take it easy. Later on.